everyone today we're back with another video today i'll be showing you my desk tour this is just a quick overview my desk is from ikea so is the chair starting with the top shelf we have some pandora jewelry that i got for my boyfriend pictures of my family and i and also collage my friend gave me here is a ceramic piece that i got when i went out to dinner one day for my birthday febreze and a water bottle i got from korea in the middle I have my army bomb of course, a uh, love yourself answer album. I also have two big photo prints of Jungkook and Taeyang I got from love yourself. Over here I have an Instax photo Polaroid printer and also a regular Polaroid camera. In this mason jar I have fortune cookie fortunes, I like to collect these, they're really cute. And on the side here I have Pandora bags that my jewelry came in and I have a cute photo book of my boyfriend and I. Now onto my wall. First I have these two photo banners that I got from concerts. This is from City Field and this one is MetLife. I also have some three photo cards. Uh, just a card someone gave me. And I also have rows of Polaroids. So this row is for my friends. I still have to print more, of course. This one row is dedicated to my cousin. And the last row is dedicated to family. Now I have a dream catcher over here. And this is my picket fan that I got from the Love Yourself concert. And I hold it up by push pins. Moving on to the desk itself. Uh, first I have a lamp. I have some Vaseline, a fidget spinner, some loose hair ties, and loose change it looks like. I also have an alarm clock and a water bottle. Now I always have my phone on my desk usually. In this container I have my most used mild liners. I also have Faber-Castell black pens, they come in different sizes. I also have my jelly roll pens in sparkly silver and white. This one pen my friend gave me from China. And of course I have my Muji pens. In the back I just have some scissors and a ruler. Beside that I have this tiny Jungkook figurine. It's so cute. <laughs> I have a picture of my boyfriend and I also, picture of my cousin, yeah, just some photos that I like. In the back I have some binder clips of different sizes. In the middle you can see that I have erasers and scissors and glue. And also here I have more adhesive, so glue sticks, double sided tape. In the next compartment I have my whiteouts. And these are tiny stay below mini highlighters. Here I have a dongle port that I use for my laptop and editing. And this is where I like to keep my chargers and my AirPods. In this compartment, usually my camera sits here, but I'm filming it with it obviously. And this is the charger. Here we have some Apple Pencil grips when I use them. Extra washi tape. And these are a set of pastel markers that I like to draw with. In the back, we just have some pens, pencils, markers that I don't use often. And in the empty space on the side, I like to keep my iPad Pro. And underneath is my laptop. Moving on to the side of my desk, I like to have candles and lit them because they smell good. I have my keys and this pouch and some photos of BTS and my brother. In the pouch, I usually keep things like my keys, my wallet, because I don't really like holding purses. Moving down, I have books that I'm reading. This is my K-pop journal, my bullet journal, another book that I'm reading, and in this small Muji book, I have my YouTube schedule. Here, I just have some palace stickers from orders, uh, my washi tape. This is just some of my washi tape. Here I have Faber-Castell watercolor pencils for when I do art. Now you can go to the side and see hidden apartments. These are pattern papers that I have for journaling. An empty binder. And these three folders I keep my K-pop journaling papers like scrap papers and photos.
empty lined paper. In this book, I like to write the lettering and then cut it out for my journals. A sketchbook, some more extra folders, BTS collectible magazines, and these two are recipe books. Moving down to the bottom shelf, I have these folders. This one yellow folder is just filled with empty graph and line paper that I haven't used yet. The other ones are blank. These are all notebooks that I used to use for school. In this binder holder, we have my notebook which I learned Korean in. We have an extra journal for my second K-pop journal. Two small spiral notebooks. This is a sketchbook. I also want to introduce you guys to this drawer because I like to keep some other art stationery stuff here. Paint brushes, paint, canvas holders. Underneath I have a big container of Prismacolor colored pencils. I like to keep a hole puncher, a staple. I also have a relaxing coloring book, a lettering book more sketchbooks and below these are books that teach you how to do things like watercolor and draw faces instructional type books Here we have fabric that i used to use for projects friendship bracelet string here is a tool to make perfect circles and underneath i have a container that i hold my extra washi tape here we have some canvases that i use for painting underneath is thicker paper so that is what is in that drawer Finally, we're moving on to my cart. I got this cart from Michaels. In the three top cup holders, this back one is where I hold extra pens and pencils and refillables that I have not used yet. And in the next glass container, we have all my brush pens and some extra super tips that I don't use as often. I mostly only have Artist Loft brush pens and Tombow Duo brush pens. Finally, we have this very aesthetic pencil holder. It's my favorite. So in the front, I keep my Zebra Mildliner brush pens. On the right, I have the regular Mildliner highlighters. And in the back are my super tips. Here I just have an ink pad and some stamps. I have a big container. So in the front, my memo sheets, post-its. Here I have some push pins, my sticker sheets, and I also have more sticker sheets in these boxes. In the middle I have adhesive dots for putting things on the wall, some index cards and reinforcements, some extra Polaroids. Here are my sticker sheets, some Halloween coloring books painting and in the back I have my passport with my RJ case to the side we have some pencil sharpeners then I have my wiper from my iPad ring tools this is tape that I got from my BTS concert in here I keep my Pigma microns and some charcoal pens more Faber-Castell pens I also keep some paintbrushes that I use for blending here I have a paper cutter I have some envelopes and cards. Here are where I keep my photos and photo cards. So first I have photo cards that I got from concerts and packages. And I also keep a lot of the photos that I print to use for my K-pop journals. So I just go in this container and I look through for inspiration. And I also have colored themes in here if I'm looking for a specific color or a specific artist. Now I have this tub and this is filled with all of my paints. So it has a tear that you could take out. So you take off the lid and then you pull out this small section and here I keep some washi tape for my borders around my paintings and I also have um, a lot of paintbrushes, some watercolor paintbrushes and this is masking fluid for watercolor now in the bottom section is where I keep all of my acrylic paints now onto the last tier I have these two containers and I took off the lids 
So in the left, this is where I keep my watercolor paints. On the right, I keep my gouache paints. Next to them, I have some paint palettes. Here, I have extra watercolor pencils. First, this is my Sakura Koi watercolor palette. It's portable and it has a lot of colors. These are just more paint palettes. I have some containers that I use for water holding and these are all 79 cent acrylic paints from Michaels. Yeah, so that is my desk tour, my shelf, my setup, my stationery, where I keep my items. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.